Anyone lucky enough to have gone on a hunt with the late GCF Dalziel knows that they've been guided by the best. Working out of his famous camp at Blue Sheep Lake in northern British Columbia, he led hunters into the mountains for many years in pursuit of the best of the high country wildlife. The record books for moose, grizzly bear, caribou, mountain goat, and stones sheep are filled with the names of hunters who were guided by this legend of the outdoors. Dal himself harvested record stones sheep in 1964 and in 1965, which are still in the top 10 sheep ever taken. One of the hunters who was lucky enough to be guided by Dal was Bob Hansen of Arizona. On his first hunt with Dal in the spring of 1970, he took a record grizzly bear and a record black bear. Bob still remembers every detail of his hunt with Dal noting that the great guide knew every inch of his territory and every move of the animals they were hunting. When Bob and his wife Arlene, both life members of the Wild Sheep Foundation, conceived the idea of creating an award for outstanding guides, they immediately decided that it should be named for GCF Dalziel. Dal had distinguished himself over a long career, particularly as a sheep guide and today's guides will be honored to be connected with an award named for such a professional. To be considered for the GCF Dalziel Outstanding Guide Award, the following must be demonstrated. A deep commitment to high ethical standards and sportsmanship, the esteem of the hunting community and his or her peers. Consistent willingness to go the last mile to ensure a quality hunting experience for his or her clients. Knowledge of the country and the wild game animals inhabiting that country, an unfailing sense of humor, a work ethic, and a dedication to the health, safety, and well-being of his or her clients. In other words, be a lot like Dow. The great outdoors, magnificent creatures and breathtaking surroundings, the experience of a lifetime. These great hunts are made possible by dedicated guides like GCF Dalziel, and the winners of the award that bears his name. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the GCF Dalzell Outstanding Guide Award, award founders and sponsors, Bob and Arlene Hansen. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Another year, another great convention. I'm sure you have enjoyed it as much as we have. This is the 19th year that Arlene and I have presented this award. It had modest beginnings in 2001. Since then, it's become one of the most popular and significant awards presented at this annual convention. Many great guides have won the award over the years, and tonight's winner will continue that tradition. I will urge you, please keep on nominating your favorite guide. We consider those who may not have won tonight, but we consider those who have been nominated in the past. Before Arlene identifies this year's winner, I would be remiss if I did not add one more tribute to the many that have been delivered this week in memory of Jason Hairston. You saw him earlier tonight in the last sheet camp. He was a great guy. He gave freely of his time and his treasure, including awarding a package consisting of Kuyu gear and a hunt trip to the hunter who will, to the guide who will be identified in a few minutes. With me on the stage is Brendan Burns from Kuyu, who will be here to do the honors. And now I'd like to pass the podium to Arlene, who will say a few words about this year's winner. Good evening, Wild Sheep family and friends. Welcome. This has been a great convention. This year's Outstanding Guide Award goes to a man who has been guiding in the Yukon Territory for over 40 years, and for the past 17 years has worked for the Olmsteads at Prophet Musqua. Voted by his peers as Outstanding Guide of the Year in British Columbia, he is a man without parallel who has striven to harvest old, mature rams and has guided his hunters to 110 stone and doll sheep, as well as moose, elk, bear, and caribou. 
The esteem Gary is held in by his hunters, fellow guides, wranglers, and outfitters comes from his passion, personality, and tenacity. The way he treats his co-workers' horses, his co-workers rather, horses, and his love for the country and animals where he plies his trade. His sense of humor is legendary, and he is always conscientious about his clients' skills and welfare. This father of two adult sons lives in the Toronto area and is a steel worker during the off-season. Gary Van Hee loves ketchup on everything <laughs> and is, in, is incredibly fit and is the mayor of Richards Creek and now a GC, D, GCF Dalzell Outstanding Guide winner. Let's welcome Gary Van Hee to the stage. We have an additional treat tonight to Mara Schweigert, a longtime friend from Tucson, initially from Cody, a lot of things happen in Cody, is on stage with us. She created this novel Guide Award Bronze over 20 years ago and will help present the award. God bless each and every one of you. Thank you. Hold it, hold it, hold it with <laughs> wild sheep, wild places. Thank you. <laughs> 